Today's story is The Happy Owls by Celestino Piatti. Once upon a time, in an old stone ruin, there lived a pair of owls. All the year through, they were very happy. On a farm nearby, there were all kinds of barnyard fowl who did nothing all day but eat and drink. And after they had finished eating and drinking, they began to fight with one another. They could never think of anything better to do. One day, the peacock noticed the owls and he wanted to know why they did not quarrel. Why was it they were so happy? When they heard his question, the other birds said, why don't you visit the owls and ask them how they can live together so peacefully? With a deep bow, the peacock agreed to call on the owls. The peacock carefully preened his gorgeous plumage and strutted off in all his finery. At the owl's house, he spread out his tail feathers and rustled them and clawed at the ground to attract the owl's attention. The owls blinked their big round eyes when they heard what he wanted to know. Well, Mr. Peacock, we'll tell you, but first go and fetch all your friends. When the chickens, the ducks, the geese, and all the others were assembled, the owls began their story. When spring comes, we are happy to see everything come to life after the long winter sleep. The trees put forth their buds and leaves. The meadows are covered with thousands of tiny flowers and birds everywhere are singing merrily. Later, around every flower, bees and bumblebees are buzzing and all kinds of little flies are humming. Butterflies flit to and fro, gathering honey from the golden sunflowers. Then we know that summer is here. And when everything is green and growing, and the trees nod their leafy crowns to us in the warm sunshine, we sit in a shady nook in the cool forest and are at peace with the world. Then autumn comes. And the spider, who has waited through the glorious summer under a leaf, comes out and spins her web to hold up the tired leaves a little longer. We rejoice to see her. And finally, when all the leaves are fallen and the earth is covered with snow, we come back and are cozy in our old home for winter is here again. What nonsense, screamed the chickens, the ducks, the peacocks, and the geese, for they had understood nothing of all this. Do you call that happiness? And the barnyard fowl, who preferred to go on preening, stuffing themselves and quarreling, turned their backs on the owls and went on living as before. But the owls snuggled still closer to each other, blinked their big round eyes, and went on thinking their wise thoughts. Thanks for watching Storytime with Miss Rose. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for more videos. If you enjoyed the book, there's a link to purchase in the description below. Thank you.